Hi, welcome back to Made in Abyss. Today we're doing episode 7 and 8 of season 2 of Made in Abyss. The the City of the Scorching Sun, or whatever else it was, <laughs> was the name of it, I, and I forgot. Anyway, we're going to be continuing, and we're going to do it now. So, see you there. Oh, we're going to learn more about uh, this part now? This was the last thing we saw from everybody. Jesus. <laughs> what is that? Seems like a different creature altogether. So I guess this, the, 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 the citizens of the city, like these guys, made the relics and stuff, right? Oh, they found like a reverberating stone? Ah. Ah, okay. So that explains why they got down there. Did someone else go up with him or? Oh, yeah, they did. Oh, boy. So the blessing didn't work on those. Those guys. God, it's such an interesting, uh development there. I mean, they obviously found someone who was having, who had a white, well, sorry, a reverberating stone. Who, who the hell were they? And why did they have one? Oh, she's Irumiui! Boy. Oh! The little creatures! <laughs> well, they gotta find those shells, right? To stay alive in or something? <laughs> I think I recognize it from the shop in the marketplace. Huh. I guess they don't require much. It seems like they're self sustaining at least. Uh, that's what it seems like anyway, unless they require the. The light from the sun or whatever the hell that comes from, I don't know. They haven't really shown where the light comes from. It doesn't really make sense for there to be light down here. Yet there is! Uh, constantly, anyway. <laughs> so... Very curious to find out what the hell is making the light. Is it a relic? Is it a replica of the sun? What is it? Radiation? Oh... Yeah, you don't want to drink water, you don't know where it's from. That, uh, that's a death sentence, probably. Oh, what's up? Oh no, do you have a fever? Or cold? Or... Oh. Cute. たくさん子供。でも女の子供いるみゆいだけ。だからあんたきっとても可愛がってくれた。でもいるみゆい調べたら子供できないわ。あ、そうで、エグザミンドヘアでディントライトトゥトゥトゥトゥトゥトゥト
蹴りの跡がある受け固まった大型生物の死骸我々はこれを作った原因を口にしたのかベラカどうするここ以外に Is this a creature? あ、持ち帰る我々に必要な水だその上で知らせねばねぶここれカバンの中にあったんだけど何かわかる神がかりの預言者は何か予感があったのだろうか What is that? Oh, yeah, they showed that at the end of the last episode, I think. It looked like a heart of some kind. Yeah. Oh, that was good. Boiling didn't help. Oh, they're dead now? I guess, yeah, that makes sense. Their whole brain is wood. Ah, yeah, the, the different like, categories of relics. Oh, well, good thing they haven't done that yet. What? Oh. Did she wish for immortality or something? Oh. You have faith, Master Prophet. その末の妹だ。救う手がありながら差し伸べねば、我々は再び居場所を失う。お願い、治って。デブ行こう。全然痛くない。おお。Still didn't reverse anything. What the fuck? イルミウイ、こっちおいで。Doesn't hurt at all. 元気なのに、でも痛くないって。Why is she so happy about that? She was probably thinking, I don't want this to hurt anymore, so that's probably what happened. Right? Like, that's the most logical thing I can think of. Ah! Uh. No, okay, it literally is. She just, she's still going through it. She just wished it wouldn't, it would stop hurting. That's all. Oh, no. Okay. What the fuck? She just wish for a child. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh my god. Oh. This is so fucked up, man. That is the worst. Oh no, she's starting to now? What are you feeding her? <sighs> oh, God.
What a fucked up show. <laughs> okay, what the fuck did you give her? What, uh... It's all good. They really did it, huh? They really fucking chopped her up and fed them to everybody. I'm oh, sorry, uh, what's the gun did? So, how is Faputa born if Irimu is just a dead food now? And how did she heal everyone by feeding them her? <sighs> Okay, um, let's go on to the next episode. Who, who are you? You're not the same. So sad. But you're not the same. Like, who are you? What are you? Ohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohohoh
All because of the goddamn water. The fucking water. Oh my god! What is happening to Bailoff? Oh my god, the babies are getting bigger. It is... Oh... Is, is Bailoff just going crazy because of the concept of what's happening? Uh, oh. Oh. What? ふくすうあるものなんだよね、これ。鑑賞記者たちも初めて見る風じゃなかったし。彼らに探してもらってたのさ。本当間に合ってよかったよ。とこうしてるのさ。いよいよだね。彼女の本当の願いを見届けに行
もうイルビューに体を渡してからこれは名残なんだけどねどうして鑑賞機も言ってたのに大人が使うのは適してないってベコ神がかりだなんて言うけどねやるだけやらないとダメなんだああ見てきたじゃん君が呪いの大穴ならここで祈るだけのものだ That's why when they went in it had like a jelly effect It is her! The whole village is her! <laughs> 我々はここに集められたんだ闇の中でかすかな信号が伝わってくるみんなイルミュイに身も心も食わせ彼女の一部となっていた They are villagers, okay イルミュイはすでに人としての知性は失ってしまっていた、oh, no. ただ一つだけただ一つの目的で生き続けていた of her みんなを食い new wish, I guess 本教の力を吸い上げまずきゃ Oh. So it is a child of hers. Okay. A an actual child that survived. So it carried kind of her own consciousness into her. They were just dead people, like this was hell or something. So she was just taking care of her children this whole time. Oh. I don't want to fucking watch this anymore, man. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and hello, here we are. <laughs> so that's the story. Two episodes worth. Uh -huh. Oh. 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 Something to do with Rag then. I have such an overwhelming feeling of discovery right now. I want to meet Fabata. Or that. That's also a good one. <laughs> like I said, I, I have such an overwhelming feeling of discovery and just uh, awe in my in my head right now um, because it, the whole story we just uncovered finally. Why why everything it happens? And God, what a story it was. Of course, they're going to play the one song in Maiden Abyss that makes me cry every time I hear it. The the Maiden Abyss theme itself. I don't know what it's called, actually, but it's it's the general theme of the Maiden Abyss show at the very end there, um, which I listen to frequently. Um, I have listened to frequently for the past year because it, it makes me feel uh, an untold amount of joy. And I always tear up when I hear it. And I do now. Like, look at me. Like, I'm a fucking mess because I'm such a soy boy for this show. Um, but yeah, extremely well told story. Uh, <laughs> what a what an unravelment, or uh, should I say, what a what a reveal <laughs> that she was the village and all this shit happened to her in the past. Um, kind of sad that she couldn't tell uh, that this whole thing is just happening. 
But I'm glad we learned the truth. And from now on, let's see what happens, especially with the rag and everything else. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just curious to, to watch more. So I hope you all enjoy the reaction anyway. <laughs> I'll see you for the next episode, probably after another session of something else. Uh, I record this is recorded like a long time before I actually post it, so um, I don't know. We'll see though. Uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed. Sincerely, uh, this was tough to get through, <laughs> uh, as you can probably imagine. And yeah, I'll see you later. Bye.